Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Ebony and today I am taking you guys on a tour of my small apartment. So let's go ahead and get into it. So this entryway hutch is what I sort of call it because we use it for storage space, um, stores all of our laundry detergent and things like that. Um, and then the decor on top is pretty much from TJ Maxx or Hobby Lobby. So that greenery is from TJ Maxx, the lamp is from TJ Maxx, the brown piece of decor is actually a gift from my sister when she went to Jamaica. That mirror is from TJ Maxx. The glass vase with the plant, um, so the fake plant was purchased from Hobby Lobby. That candle and that frame was purchased from TJ Maxx as well. So we definitely keep it simple up here. I like it nice and clean, but also used for storage space underneath, of course. And then that rug we also purchased from TJ Maxx. I just felt like we needed something here to tie this all together for when you walk into the apartment. The next space is our kitchen area. You guys know I like to keep it simple and minimum up top just so it looks like we have a bigger space than what we really have. But all of these pieces up top I did purchase from either TJ Maxx, Marshalls, or Home Goods. So always go check out those stores first before you go to the big stores like West Elm and places like that because those places are fairly expensive and we definitely like to keep it budget friendly on this channel. I purchased that hand wash and dishwash bottles from Amazon and then I also want to show you guys my bar stools so I purchased those from TJ Maxx I didn't want to do the dining room table as I mentioned in the previous video so we went with these the next space we're going to be looking at is the living room slash dining area so for the dining area I decided to do my desk and then here's the living room area I definitely kept it very simple basic colors so no bright colors or anything like that so here's my desk I purchased that from Target and then the plant and the the plant was actually purchased at TJ Maxx and the candle was a gift and then I did recently get a MacBook about two months ago and it has been amazing and a game changer for sure. Um, so this is the entertainment center and I purchased this from Amazon. I definitely want to go for the more modern look. Um, so here's some of the decor that I have on the entertainment center and most of this stuff to be honest you guys I purchased from like TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Home Goods, one of those three stores. That picture frame that says my first home, that was actually a gift from the real estate agent. She gave us a drawing of our first home as like our selling gift. So like that was like the most thoughtful gift anybody could ever give us after selling our home because it was so bittersweet. But um, we definitely appreciate that photo. Um, and then this right here is just a basket from TJ Maxx. Um, and I just store our blankets in there. Our furniture is from Ashley Furniture. The pillowcases are from Amazon. So I'll link those below and then the middle table or middle chair whatever you want to call it we actually purchased that from Facebook marketplace for like $80 so we definitely got a steal on that because it is definitely heavy along with um, definitely gives that bohemian look the rug that you just saw I did purchase that from Amazon so I'll link that down below the lamp is from TJ Maxx the end table is from TJ Maxx as well so just wanted to show you guys what the kitchen looks like whenever you're standing in the living room. So this is the view that we get once we're, um, whenever we're in the living room. Before we go into the next room, I just want to stop and say thank you guys for watching this video so far. Don't forget to subscribe and I would love to hear your comments down below on how I've decorated the place. Just give me any opinions. It, was this any inspiration to you or anything like that? So the next area we're going into is our guest slash Eleni's bathroom. So once again, we keep it very simple. I did add some pops of pink just because she is using this bathroom. But that shower curtain I purchased from Amazon. Um, the Towels I purchased from Home Goods. The white flower I purchased from TJ Maxx. Um, all of the like soap, the soap dispenser and lotion dispenser, and that greenery. All of that was actually from TJ Maxx as well. Next space is Eleni's closet. So we definitely 
did a makeover on this room and i'll link it down below if you want to check it out it does look a little bit different than it did we, re we have rearranged it since then but for the most part it's very functional to be honest she doesn't use this room as much as i was hoping for so that's why we actually took the egg chair out and i'll show you guys that in her room but um for the most part it's still functional she still comes in here occasionally um it still stores a lot of her stuff so um we're definitely we definitely appreciate this space another thing i want to mention is thank you guys for sticking along with me through this journey i know i have like post it regularly and then stop posting and then post it again so hopefully this time will be very consistent um i am going to try my best to post every sunday and give you guys some type of organization or some type of inspiration so i hope you guys subscribe to my channel so the next space we're in is Eleni's room. So there's the egg chair I was talking about. And this is a unicorn theme room. I do have a makeover video. However, it was at the old house, but pretty much decorating the room with these pieces. And it pretty much looks the same. I did change up a couple of things, but for the most part, everything's the same. If you wanna check out that video, we definitely keep it colorful and she definitely loves unicorns she's obsessed with unicorns but um another thing we did we did spray paint that mirror gold so it was like a teal blue and we painted it gold um, and then up here we store all of her trophies from her pageants also i think she has a couple from gymnastics as well but her bed we actually purchased this at like a consignment sale and we got a pretty good deal on her bedroom suit but then also that comforter is actually from betty's that was definitely a life changer so basically she can just zip it up to make it and um so if you guys are not familiar with betty's definitely check them out the comforter is fairly expensive but it's definitely worth the price um so this is just an overview of how her room looks um will definitely probably be changing in the next year or so but for now it definitely works for her the next room we're going into is the master bedroom very simple in here didn't want to do too much so this is the space we're using just to go to bed of course um, but i purchased that comforter i love that clay color it definitely goes with the bohemian style we're going for but um, the comforter was purchased from target that mirror was purchased from either tj maxx or i'm pretty sure it was walmart actually yeah it is walmart um and then that great night sam was purchased from the most random spot but it was from home depot um so we've had that for a while and the only decor i have on the walls is that picture that we actually had in the living room at the old house so i definitely haven't done much to this room i do have a few ideas of to put some decor above the bed but for now it's pretty functional um and we enjoy sort of the blank walls in that room um the next space I'm going to take you guys into is our bathroom. Um, we are definitely loving the two vanity sinks. Um, and then we just keep each other's stuff under each sink. So we definitely are able to keep it organized that way. This um, soap dispenser and lotion dispenser and the greenery um, was all purchased at Home Goods. Um, that sign, I actually put two pieces together from the $5 target spot and um, just glued it together and made that sign um, we are definitely going for like beiges in this bathroom but also keeping it very simple so I just recently purchased this shower curtain from home goods along with the rug from home goods I felt like it went very well together so those are the pieces we're using for the bathroom as of right now as far as the color goes um, and then just wanted to show you from in the bathroom this is how the bedroom looks um, so just giving you a different view we do have a linen closet as well and then this is the closet now this is the space I just cannot figure out how to get organized like I've rearranged I've folded clothes I've hung up I've rearranged colors um you know organized in certain colors if you guys have any tips for me to look below definitely let me know i am still working on this space it's just a lot of stuff for a small space and i'm just trying to figure out what works best for us for so for the most part it's not horrible it's just not too appealing to the eye but anyway it definitely works for us for now and hopefully that'll be a video coming up soon for you guys um so just wanted to thank you guys for watching this small apartment tour i hope it gave you some inspiration or some organization ideas or some motivation to get something done today i hope to see you guys on the next one and i'll talk to you soon bye